The World Rally Championship is back from its winter break, with an exciting brand new season kicking off with a Monte Carlo shakedown. It's been just 66 days since Elvin Evans and Scott Martin won Rally Japan, and they'll hope that form was a sign of things to come in their hunt for a first world title this season. The British duo was second fastest in the season opening shakedown. Looking forward to go. Uh, obviously, it's always a big, big build-up to a new season, but uh, yeah, just nice to be in the car. The Welshman's only full-time teammate this season will be Takamoto Katsuta, with Seb Ogier and Kalorov and Pera running part-time programmes. Thierry Nervo and the returning Oit Tanak will lead Hyundai's charge for a first driver's title at the sport's top level. Having won here in 2019, Nerville is the only active driver other than Ogier to grace the top step in Monte Carlo. The Belgians started the season strongly, with the third fastest time in Schengen. Um, it's going to be exciting, that's for sure. So, uh, yeah, I hope we're going to have a good start of the, of the weekend. And, uh, yeah, in those conditions, uh, it's going to be still a tricky event. Tanek was also flying on his return to Hyundai, the Estonian fastest through shakedown, setting a marker for his rivals on what will be his 150th rally start. The numbers are numbers, but uh, yeah, still quite exciting and uh, a bit nervous as well, you know, to start the new year, new car again, so uh, always a bit of challenge, you know. Even I've been here before, still a bit unknown, but yeah, we'll try to maximize. Tanek's teammate, Andres Mikkelsen, making his top flight return, is competing on a part-time schedule this season. And the Norwegian was still getting used to the speed of his Rally 1 car. You're back at the top level. How does it feel? <laughs> it feels, sorry for the word, fast. <laughs> Two drivers stand above the rest in Monte Carlo. Seb Loeb's incredible eight wins are only surpassed by his countryman, Seb Ogier, who has won nine times here. Another victory this weekend would see the Frenchman into double figures, and his run through shakedown proved he was here just for that. Setting a time nine tenths of a second off Tanek's fastest, and hoping the speed will stay with him for the following 17 stages. This car looks very good this year. <laughs> yeah, the, the black is fitting well, I think, to the Yaris, so hopefully the speed will follow as well. A brand new lineup for M Sport this season, with reigning British rally champion Adrian Formo joined by Gregoire Monster. The duo will be keen to rack up kilometres this year and ensure reliability. So an early issue in shakedown will hopefully not be a sign of things to come. For the run now it's not really good, we have something more on the car so we need to go back to service. It's Tanak quickest in the first shakedown session of the season, followed by Evans, Nerville and Ogier. Katsudra is fifth, followed by Mickelson, Munster and Formo. In WRC2 it's the Citroen duo of Nikolai Gryzin and Johan Russell who look the drivers to beat. First and second fastest through shakedown in the WRC2 class with Spaniard Pepe Lopez near the top of the times in his scope.